And Myers, お願いします。チャックはタランダダンの絵が出ているページを開いて、絵の下の書いてある説明を読み上げた。So,、uh, Jack、uh, opened the book to the page where the タランダダンは、like, displayed. And there, underneath the picture,、uh, he read out loud the explanation that was written. Perfect. And Sydney, let's have you read the explanation. Pteranodon wa tsubasa o motta hachu rui yokuryu no nakama de hakuaki to yu jidai no ikimono de aru kyoryu to Tomoni Yakur Rokusen Gohiaku man nen mae ni Zetsumetsu sta. So de aru has the exact same meaning of like desu or da. It just de aru is the like the written form of desu and da. Well, you know, so it's. It's just like for writing. So, since he's reading from a book, the audio is showing up rather than da. We have shita over there. The、um, do you know what hachurui means? Thankfully, one of some of us. Reptilian? Yep. <laughs> so, let's, what does this whole thing uh, say? Uh, I just said shita. <laughs>、um, We're talking about a put that I don't know. I don't know what mota, how that works here. So, mota tends to mean like to have, to carry with you. So, it's just saying it has tsubasa. What are tsubasa? Wings. Yes. So, it is a creature that has wings, specifically a hachurui, which you told me earlier was a reptile. So, Putradan is a reptile that has wings, right? Right. So, it really starts with Nakama.、Uh, Yokuryu no Nakama. Do you know what Yokuryu meant?、Uh, like a、uh, winged dinosaur.、Mm-hmm. Yep, it means winged dinosaur. So, it's the. So it's saying Putradon is one of the Nakamas. You know what Nakama means?、Uh, group? Yes, exactly. Good thing you didn't do the One Piece comrade, best friend, Nakama.、Uh, so, yeah, group.、Um, yep, so all together it is、um, Putradon is a member of the. Flying dinosaur reptilian group that has wings. And not only that, Putradons were Hakuaki to you, Jidai no Ikimono de Aru. So we have Toyu right here. What is that telling us? Uh. Actually, I have no idea what the purpose、mm. of that is. So, totally, <laughs> you. No, no kind of works. That, that wouldn't really be totally wrong. t o y u is basically used when, you have a na- when you're naming something. So, we're naming the Jidai Hakuaki. So,、um, the English translation,、oh, okay. I think, is like the Celestial. I don't know my dinosaurs. It's hard with a C. Cretaceous. Yes, Cretaceous.、Um, so、somebody studied. <laughs> so that would be the English version. But right here we just know this is the name of the Jidai, which means what?、Uh, period.、Uh, yes. Age. Yep,、uh, period or age. So that's just the name. So it basically is the same thing as saying, ah, Rokusen go hyaku man nen mai. Has the exact same meaning as. Hakuaki to you, Jidai. 
So this is the exact same thing. But most children, if they heard Hakuaki, would be like, what's that? Oh, it's the Rokusengo Hyakuman Nen Maini. Right. Um, then we have no ikimono. What's that saying? Uh, like life form. <laughs> yep. So all together, that part of the sentence is saying the putra dawn is a life form from the era of the 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 rokusen go hyakuman and mae, and of those ikimono, it is within the group of yokoryu, the flying dinosaurs that are the otherwise known as the lizards that have wings. And then, since um, yokoryu and kyoryu are theoretically different things, they're not kyoryu, they're, they're similar. So that's why it says over here, kyoryu to tomo ni. What does that mean? Kyoryu to yeah. tomo ni. So, uh, in the company of uh, the, the land dinosaurs. Yes. Um, and they... around. 6,500, uh, uh, wait. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's, no. there's 10,000 right there. <laughs> yeah, okay, so. Yeah, it's, it's hot. Uh, uh, this is like so hard to. <laughs> okay, that's uh, three zeros, and then we can do one, two. So five. like what? Six million? No, sixty-five uh, million. Something like that. No, six. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not quizzing you. Man just gets a lot of zeros added on top of that. We got the sixty-five. <laughs> We're good. We're good. It's, it's every time I have like to do this. number conversions. Too hot. Because too man numbers. is ten thousand, right? So I add yes. two. So we have okay, 500 so and then we're adding it's the like 10, a thousand thousand so it's a mi yeah it's 65 mi million no yeah 65 million i got i got the zeros okay. i think so it's, it's yes uh, we're doing english that'd be three yes looks like 50 65 million seems right <clears throat> <laughs> probably <laughs> okay may Give or take one zero. <laughs> give, give or take we're one ball zero. parking it. <laughs> uh, they were uh, Detsumetsu. What could that uh, be? Ex extinct? Yep. So uh, they, they, were, they were extinct around 65 million years ago. Yes. Perfect. Nice. And Myers. Zetsumetsite to aniga kita. So, uh, what is Zetsumetsu? Annie asked. <laughs> yep. Super useful, just in case we didn't know that word. Um, and Myers, <laughs> I'll let you do the next one as well. Chi kyu jo kara sono nakama ga ito mo inaku natte shimau koto da yo. Uh, GQ, so GQ is like Earth, the globe. Uh, yep. Joel, Joel, hold on, I'm cheating. Wait. I was grabbing you the kanji. Ue. Oh, on Earth, haha, <laughs> yeah. Yep. Uh, it, oh no. Um, no. The this right here doesn't totally matter. You can tell there's a one here, right? And we know this is a counter. Ito. So we know we're counting something and that they're ina mo inaku. You know what mo inaku means? Uh I, I'm well, guessing in this case it's like the negative form of imas, but yes, it is. 
So it's a negative form of ya, so this is imasen. Okay. Or inatta. But um, it's doing the mo here, it's conveying not, not even. That's kind of what the mo is conveying here. Not even an ito itad. Uh, ito, what do you think that means? We're counting something. What are we counting? Uh, assumably the, the dinosaurs. Yes, ito means one large animal. Ito. So, ito mo inakunatte shimao. So I'm guessing this is just the explanation for what an extinction actually is. It is. Uh, above on the earth, uh, that the dinosaurs, not mm. even one. Uh, Continue the, the to part exist. that's throwing me off is the yeah that the that's the part that's kind of throwing me off because it's like not it's like not even a single di dinosaur survived is what this is yeah. saying. So um, specifically, he's making it more general by saying "sono nakama." So extinction means that those within whatever group you're talking about, when not a single animal within that group exists, then "toyu koto" that's the koto here. That is what "zetsu means. So the, the reason why it's ending with "koto" right here is just saying "zetsu um, metsu to you wa blah 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 koto da." Nice. Yeah, ito is one large animal. Yeah, just wait, 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 no, no, wait. What? Oh, Archie. Ah. Um. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Sorry about technical bit difficulties. So we oh, started no. reading without you, but you didn't miss much. No, that's okay. Uh, Happy to join in. Yep. So we, we read the book, and the book told us that um, Yokoryus have gone instinct. Wow, who, who would have thunk that? And, um, and suddenly the main character is coming to a, some kind of realization. Hmm. Archie, you get to read this sentence. All right. Um, uh, so no uh, pterodon uh, ga me no mai ni iru te uh, iu koto wa koko wa uh, 6,500 man nen yori motto mai no sekai datte iu no ka um So this, um, behind the eyes of this Pteranodon. Hmm, kono me no mae ni is actually referring to jakku no. Oh. <laughs> um. So before Jack's eyes, I guess. Hi. Yep. Um, what, what, what did he see with his eyes? Something that probably shouldn't have actually existed. The Pteranodon. Yep, that's why it says, Sono Pteranodon ga me no mai ni iru. So it's saying that Pteranodon that I can see with my eyes, it's right before my eyes, the Pteranodon. So you koto wa, koko wa 6,500 man nen yori motto mai no sekai datte iu no ka. So it's from more than six, uh, 6,500 years um, ago, or like... Uh, you forgot the, the 10,000 in there. 10,000? <laughs> <laughs> so so in, in English, we've decided it's about 65 million, give okay. or take a zero. I think I counted it right. It's from the world of like 65 million years ago. Right. Mai. Or more than. Yes. Because um, what you what you didn't get to see, that everybody else got to see, was that uh nen mai. All these dinosaurs mm. were detsumitsushita. So since it's existing, it has to be moto mai. Right. Uh, 
Uh, and then you had the Toyu no Ka. That's the only part that didn't translate. Does it change the meaning or? Not really. It's just like. Like, isn't in it? Other, or... Yeah. So, in other words, the fact that I can see a Putra Dawn right before my eyes, that would mean that right now we are in a world that is set before the 65 million years of this. Uh, so you gotta say in other words, you can say in other words is also a way to translate to you look up. Got it. Sonakotoarienai! Such a thing is impossible! And Myers, onegaishimasu. Onie-chan, watashi anoko ni kitte miru. So, so itte ani wa nawabashigo o ori hajimeta. Uh, so, uh, Annie is uh, telling her brother that uh, she is going to uh, try and, and, like, question, try to talk to the, mm. the Pteranodon. Uh, and then saying that, uh, she began descending the rope ladder. Yes. Directly saying, Big Brother, I want to ask that Putradon a question, not that child a question. So the Miru is not really asking permission, it's just making a statement. I want to do this. Shite Miru, I want to try this. Which obviously she, she, she doesn't ask for, which is different because like earlier we saw like, uh, like, Ite Minai, like earlier it's in like a couple of weeks ago. The Minai is more like the asking for permission or inviting. We do just, I want to try. I want to ask him a question. I'm down. Yamiro, Annie! Stop it, Annie! And Sydney, what do you guys Uh, Jack got to me, no more. Kikazu Aniwa Sasato Jimen ni Orite. いた。息。まるで仲良しの友達に会うように寺丼に近づいていた。This oh no right here is the pronoun no. What is it referring to? Uh any? It's actually refer Uh, is it? Cause, cause uh, Kikazu is while not listening, right? So I assume. Uh, it's it's not uh, it is without listening, but it's the tomedu. I'm checking tomedu. Tomedu yeah, is to stop. Part. There's no way any will stop. <laughs> Maybe it's Annie. I'll I'll allow Annie. Now I'm like, oh, I'm doubting myself. I'm gonna take a picture. <laughs> uh, ah, just in case. I was thinking it was kotoba <laughs> for whatever thing, as in not listening to the words. Because uh, she's not listening to Jack. Um, but it might make more sense to just be Annie. Hi. What does this say? Pretty sure it's kotoba. Jack ga tomeru no tomeru kotoba. Sound weird. Uh. Is it this is any mo kikazu? Kikazu. I don't know. Just ignore it. The translation's the same no matter what, so it doesn't matter. Okay. Uh. So she promptly. Uh. Headed down to the ground. I don't know what iki is it for. I thought... Um. So iku, like ikimas. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, uh, ikimas. There's a rule in Japanese when writing, so people don't talk like this. But you can delete mas and do this to make an and. So it's ori de iki. 
Do you know why it's using Iki now? Since uh, because she's going away from the speaker. Yes, exactly. It's so uh it's like uh she was meeting a friend that she knows totally or like very well and uh approached the pterodon. Yeah, what is the yo doing here? Uh you know like yes, yes, in a way. Fine. Exactly. Yep, perfect. So without listening to Jack, who's trying to stop Annie, Annie just um, really fast goes, climbs down to the ground away from Jack, and almost as if she's trying, she's going over to visit a friend, she gets closer to the putredon. Woo! And oh, I understand what you mean by the, the no meaning kotoba now, because it's like uh, words telling her to stop. That makes yeah, sense. Yeah, he's trying to stop. To that. Yeah. But it could also be Jack who's trying to stop Annie. But so I'm like, it, it could be either. I'm raw. I'm like, ah. So sometimes, like, it, it, it doesn't really matter which one it is because the meaning's the same with the sentence. And he's trying <laughs> to stop her no matter what. But uh, I will ask a Japanese speaker which one it is. Oshiete puteradon, which is teach me puteradon. So this is the next chapter. Uh, so the chapters are short in this book. And our first sentence is going to go to Archie. Um, Annie ga putera no don ni te o um, te o nobashita no o mite um, Jack wa uh, iki o nonda. Uh, okay, build of the sentence first. Uh, so Annie um, reached out like her hand to the puteranodon. Uh, Oh, I'm still trying to figure out how the mite works. So to the first what's going on? So 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 what's going on is that wa is the actual um subject marker. Like people use confusing words for things, but wa always marks the subject, but ga marks the most important thing of the sentence. So Annie is pretty important because that is the view that Jack is doing iki o nonda because he just mitad Annie. Oh, okay. Right, Jack. Jack um took a breath. Uh, kind of. You know what? Or... So if I show you the kanji for nomu, mm -hmm. you know what this means? Nomu to drink. Yes. Oh. So what do you think drinking a breath would mean? Ah, uh... it's a gulp. Ah, oh, okay. Think so. Yeah, I, can check. I can see that. So Jack yeah. took a gulp on seeing Annie reach out her hand to the Pateranodon. Hi, perfect. And next is going to be Myers. Annie wa dare to demo sugu tomodachi ni narita garu. Annie. Uh, always, well, I don't want to say always, but Annie is quickly able to become friends. Well, no, there is a want there. So Annie always mm -hmm. wants, I, I don't want to say always, but Annie wants to become friends with anyone. Super it's, fast. But yeah, <laughs> that's an awkward sentence. It is an awkward sentence. Because Tagaru is to want to do. So it's kind of like saying she wants to become friends with people as fast as possible, I guess. Yeah. So she's not like, oh, I want to be friends with everybody, but like being cautious or anything or slowly making their friendship. She wants a friendship. She does it fast. 
runs, <laughs> gets it done. Um, and Sydney, I'm going to go to you. But I have to let go of it. But it would be better if we just leave, left it alone. Yep. And I'll give you the next one as well. Ani, sonna ni chikazui chicha dameda. You should not get that close, Ani. That's bad. Yeah. Dame. And um, Archie, when you guys see us. Jack さけぶの木風。あ、兄はあ、ペテロのどんに話しかけながら、あ、とさかに触ったり、日々をおそらく首を so who has the Tosaka? Um Buteranodon. Yes, yes. And whose kubi are we talking about? Uh, Annie. Annie's it's actually Putradon's. Putradon's. Okay. Yep. Because Annie is gonna nod it. The kubi. You know what nade, 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 nade do? Uh, no, I'm not. So nade, <laughs> nade do means to pet something. Oh, okay. Pet, pet, pet. So, so jaku ga sakebu no kikazu, which is the thing we're debating. Is that saying, it doesn't matter if that's is no as kotoba or any meaning is basically the same. Don't need to know. Wait, what is it? Uh, no, just this is the exact same thing we saw last time. We had the verb no and then kikazu, mo kikazu. So this no is either referring to the word kotoba, like jack no kotoba, or it's referring to Annie as a person, but the translation's the same. So like we know what's going on. Jack ga sakebu no, sakebu no mo kikazu. What does that mean? Um, without without uh, without hearing. Yep. In this case, listening would be a little bit better translation. So, well, okay. listening to Jack, who sakebus. What sakebu mean? Um, to. Screen, screen. Yep. So oh, without, ignoring without Jack's screams. Jack screams. Uh, Annie, hanash kaketa. What does hanash kaketa mean? It starts to talk. Yep. Who did she talk to? The puteranodon. Yes. And what else does she do to the puteranodon? And she pets. She pets so. it. Yep. Uh, where does she pet him? She pets it in two places. His neck. Yep. And uh, I'm actually not sure what Tosaka means. Nice. So the official meaning is crest, which you also, I feel like, would not know what that means. I had to Google it. It is this area. It is the okay. weird stuff that bird creatures tend to have on top <laughs> of their heads. Just like that. It's not so important. <laughs> <laughs> Very important couple of us. Um and Myers, what do you guys do? Uh it's a nani no Uh so that's like uh uh what, what like wondering what the hell are you saying? No, what are they talking about? Specifically what are you talking about? Hanashteru? Because um because there's lots of different words that be uh referring to people talking, like making noises. Hanasu Insinuates you're having a kind of conversation with somebody, 
but you might be talking a little bit more, but it's still like someone is listening to you talking. So you need to have two people to harness it. Uh, not that long ago, we saw like a siloquy, a sil sil hitogoto ni, uh, would be like talking to yourself. So there's different uh, talking words. Like yobu, for example, we've seen quite a few times, means like the call out to somebody, but you don't need a conversation for yobu. Yobu can just be like, hey, hey, and then it's done, and that's daijobu. But if a hanasu was, hey, hey, that'd be weird. <laughs> like, where's the content? We need a story, you know? Um, and, um, ジャックは大きく息を吸い込んだ。あ、オッケー。よし、僕も行くぞ。行って、あの生き物を調べてみよう。そして分かったことを記録するんだ。Okay. Uh, Jack, uh, sucked in a, a big breath. Uh, took a, took in a deep breath. Probably. Yep. Uh, okay. Uh, all right. I'll come down to. I'll try and uh, chat with that uh, uh, living thing. <laughs> so, shirabedu uh, means to like do research on to research something, to search. So, he's gonna oh, research. I, I, I mix it up with shaberu. Shirabedu. So I'm gonna go research that guy. Theoretically, it's like to look up, but he, he's he's using it as like to investigate. Since we have kiroku over here, you know what kiroku means? A record. Yep. So, soして wakatta koto o kiroku suru nda. What does that mean? Uh, he'll record the things he un he understands. Yep, because he's gonna shirabedu. So he's gonna do some research. That's the word. Research right. for the animal. He's gonna write down a whole bunch of things. He's like, I am going to become archaeologist. Um, Myers, what do you guys Uh, Jack wa soro soro to nawa uh bashiko o orita. Uh, furimuku to me no mai no pateranodon ga ita. Uh, surudoku uh, kere kere shitte me de. Uh, so Jack uh, kind of carefully or, or slowly uh, made his way down the rope ladder. And I'm not sure what footing. So when you're making, when you're going down a rope ladder, which direction would your face normally be? Uh, I suppose looking down a little bit at your hands, probably. Yeah, so you'd be kind of facing the direction of the tree. However, the putteradong is not toward the tree, right? It's it's over here. Yeah. Oh, so is because... this? Are you referencing the furi furibuku in this? Yeah. Case? Okay, okay. I wasn't sure where you were going with the explanation. Oh yeah, furibuku. So furibuku would be the turning his head over. To okay. Menomai. What does menomai mean? Uh, in front of his eyes. Yep. So how else uh, would he see the putera down? Yeah. So uh, I, we've kind of covered what that is talking about there. Uh, well, Sudoku comes from sudoi, if you know that word. Uh, is that sharp? Yes. It is sharp. It means exactly the same metaphorical meaning in English. You say sharp eye, right? Mm -hmm. So, so Jack is kind of uh, staring at the 
the Pteranodon uh, kind of intently. That's a good guess, but let's look at the particles a little bit closer for this sentence. We have an O right here. Jacku. And then mitsumeteiru. So mitsumeteiru, what does that mean? Uh, I was thinking of mitsukaru. Uh, mits, mits, is that? It's like the sound effect. Zi. Kito miru. Kito. Oh, so he's being stared at. Yes. Yep. By some kind of glaring some kira kira man. Some creature. <laughs> kira kira. <laughs> so a sharp eye is kind of blary like. It's like when the 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 spark shows up in anime. You're like, ah. it's a little quiet. Um, <laughs> Archie, on the Um. K ga totemo yawara kai no tonari no benri o sawater mitayo. So its its head is is completely soft. Um, I can't remember what bendy means. Is it convenient? so? Hen, hen, hendy. Oh, you're hendy. right. You're right. You're right. <laughs> so bendy, bendy is convenient. However, okay. hendy is the <laughs> namae of the tonari oh. no inu. Tonari ie oh. no inu. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> it's been a while, but you're right. But if it was bendy, it would be convenient. Yep, missed that. Oh. <laughs> um. Don't you wanna um. Like touch Henry, I guess. I know. I felt like I was saying that too, but I think he's saying it's just like touching. Just like Henry's. For, so yeah. it, it's weird to see me die here. Mm -hmm. for the, for, it, it feels like it should be should, just like touching Henry, you know? Mm. So like, that, that's what would make sense. <laughs> Normally, you're right. I think it's uh, so right here, miteru. That's mm -hmm. why. So if this wasn't here, so temiru has a meaning to want to try something. This is not temiru. Okay. This is sawatte iru mitai. Now it makes sense. Oh. So mitai means it looks like unless it's being attached to te. So it's not being attached to te. They're, they're tricking us. Join that do right there. Um, <laughs> what does ke mean? Um, have. That's atama. Her. Yes. Or. Her. Correct. Yep. So, you know, this, so she went very feminine-y, making a statement. Wow, this fur is so soft, just like touching Henry next door. And, um, Sydney, when you guys All right. Ani, soy, so, so it's wa inu janai dakara na. Would that be RDU? So that's that's that would be a dog, wouldn't it? Any <laughs> that, that's because it is a dog. So it's so inu janai. It's like it's isn't that it's not it's not because it's not a child. So, not a giant monster. The sentence is kind of weird. It's like not as like a vocal like question mark. You could just say it's like, Addie, that's not a dog, right? So, uh, <laughs> um, uh, Myers, on the Uh, on each one, no, so what they meet that. Uh, so Annie is like inviting uh, her brother to also pet the pteranodon. Yeah, and you can do the next sentence as well, Myers. So you are te mo jakuwa te ga dasenai. Even if you say that uh, 
Jack was unable to reach out with his hand. Hi. I feel like that's a do is more that's a nice more like won't. But basically same thing. Um Archie when it goes to us. Ma um Yate Meteo. Um trying to remember what my they means but yate mitayo means just like give it a try yeah um, so mayo um the basic meaning is to be lost but it can also have the meaning to hesitate so over here she's saying don't hesitate mayote mm. night don't hesitate just try and mm. now you can get this sentence as well right uh jaku Osoru, osoru, potero no don ni chikazuita. Um, so Jack, like, very slowly, um, came close to the potero no don. Nice. And Sunny, when you guys see us. Okay. Uh, te o nobashi, kubi ni furete miru. Shikina kan shokunda Mitikaike ga bishi bishiri haeteite birodo no yo date do data so extending his arm uh Uh, he basically patted the the neck, and uh, it was a weird uh, texture or tactile sensation. Yep. Uh, uh, short fur, something, something. I'm not sure what mm. bishiri is. So bishiri is a sound effect for like tightly packed, and haiteite means like to grow something. So in this case, it's talking about hair growing, but it can also theoretically be used with plants. It's just like in English, it means like to grow. So the hair is grown densely, basically, the short hair. Wait, pterodons have hair? Apparently, in this story. That, that's like well, the whole no, no. dinosaurs have feathers or, or not. Well, right here, <laughs> it's not really saying feathers. I'd be, I'd be a different vocab word, I think. I don't know actually, but I feel like they'd uh, use like Hana or something. Hana. I'm I'm thinking of it like down, I guess. Yeah. Well, I think they still would use Hana for that because uh, oh, the so definition of Hana like is feather. Plump. Yes, Birodo means velvet. Yep. So this is um this. Story is kind of made. Uh, Magic Treehouse books were made a long time ago, um, back before we knew that dinosaurs uh, had feathers. <laughs> you know, I see. Uh, gotta be more than ten years old, possibly twenty. I'd somewhere between there. I'd I'd have to Google it. Um, the next two sentences will go to uh, who just went. そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そう、そ
It's been over 20 years. The first Magic Trios book was written in 1992. So since it's 2022, it's been almost 30 years. Right? Older than I thought it would be. I actually thought this was like a more recent thing. Pretty old. So it'll be 30 years next month. Congratulations. Happy birthday, Magic <laughs> <laughs> I, know, but it's all... wow. I never but, heard of these when I was a kid. Wow. 